Adam, thank you. While well, the threat of severe weather is keeping 4th of July event planners on their toes, News 8's Danielle Zakowski, who is down in Franklin, Indiana, where their fireworks show, Danielle, is set to begin in just under 10 minutes. Well, yes, you can see there are a large people behind me, a large amount of people behind me, rather, and I have some new bracelets that the crowd here gave me. If you want to take a look around, there are a ton of people out here in Franklin ready to enjoy that fireworks show. Luckily for them, there's no bad weather right now, and their planned fireworks can go off tonight. We've been hearing a few going off just as some starter fireworks. We have some friends here at the fireworks show. Those shows tomorrow, they might not be so lucky. The city of Westfield announced it plans to go on with the 4th of July celebration, but we'll monitor for the weather. They have plans to modify for safety if those conditions change. This seems to be the plan for many cities. However, the Carmel Fest Facebook page says if the fireworks are canceled, the show will not be rescheduled. There would be uh, wind or lightning for that to happen. Downtown Indy Inc. has a press conference Tuesday. President and CEO Taylor Schaefer says they hope everything goes to plan, but have backup plans in place. My grandma always taught me that it's better to have a backup plan. So leading up to July 4th, we'll be in close communication with our public safety partners and weather experts. We will have contingency plans in place ranging from temporary weather delays on the evening of the 4th to a full reschedule of the event on Friday, July 5th. Wish TV has a long list of fireworks shows on our website with links to more information. You can check out that web page to get more information from each of their individual web pages on potential delays and cancellations as that happens in real time. I'm Danielle Zulkowski for Wish TV, wishtv.com and follow us on Facebook for updates.